This is what girls will resort to if we ever get rid of Planned Parenthood. <laughs> she died. No redemption this week, guys. We'll be right back. LOL. <laughs> That's Annie. And she tried to get cute in a cruise ship stairwell. But like every girl, she's unable to do anything fun. If you've ever been inside a crowded Walmart and said, I'd like to spend a solid week with these people, then cruises are for you. <laughs> they depart out of Florida, and things only get less classy from there. It's a floating nursing home. There's nothing more American than docking a 10-story food court off the coast of a starving yet scenic third world country. <laughs> They're the perfect trip for lazy white people who are too stupid or too racist to learn enough Spanish to order a margarita. Does your local Golden Corral lack breathtaking ocean views? Try Carnival Cruise Lines. Did I mention there's a rock wall? And what better way to experience Jamaica's rich zip lining culture? A cruise ship is an enormous toilet in the middle of the crystal clear Caribbean. Do husbands push their wives overboard? Or do women jump because they married a guy who considers a cruise a vacation? When I first laid eyes on Annie, I said, Danny, don't fall. But it was too late. That's why I gave her a luxurious one-night, half-day trip to Hollywood, where the only cruise I want to go down on is Penelope and this week's Web Redemption. That's my time, you fat f***s. Go get some more salt. Thank you. Oh, make it a strong one, Carlos. We have 14 shows today, and sadly, that was the best one. You got a drink ticket? Yes, I got a drink ticket, you bunch of cheaps. Join me? I'm only 17. She is only 17. 17! Attention, we are now in international waters. That doesn't matter anymore. <laughs> maritime law! Maritime law! What's maritime law? It means that legally I'm allowed to boink you. I could even murder you if I wanted, which I don't. Were you an orphan or did your mom name you Annie? Actually, my name's Anne. Who calls you Annie? Everyone. Everyone. Where are you from? South Carolina. South Carolina. You ever get to that Myrtle Beach stripper convention I've been hearing so much about? You know, I haven't. It's on the bucket list, though. You like South Carolina? I do. How do you feel about the Confederate flag? <laughs> <laughs> How many cruises have you been on? I think 16. 16 cruises? Why? We just like them. Oh, do you go with your family? Do you ever get to go alone? No, you have to be 21 to go alone. So you have to have a guardian? I can have anyone over 21. Anyone over 21 is allowed to take a 17-year-old to a cruise? Yes. They don't have to be related to you? I don't think so. Man, maritime law. Maritime law! Love it. <laughs> when are you in the 18, speaking of the, the, the day countdown. after Christmas. Oh, what a gift to all of us. <laughs> all right, what happened in that video? Um, I was sliding down railing. It didn't work out. <laughs> now, it looked like you died. Right. How painful was it? Well, I landed on the railing below me. Okay, like so that broke your fall. Me. It broke my fall in my rib. It broke your rib? Yes. Did you go see the cruise ship doctor? I did not. <laughs> is, there is a cruise ship doctor. Yes, I think so. That seems sketchy. You know there's also a morgue on a lot of cruise ships? Really? Yeah. Okay, in case people die on a cruise ship, they're not going to ruin everybody's fun. They put them on ice and keep the party going. <laughs> it's true. Yeah. I mean, I don't know if it's true. I mean, it does make sense. It doesn't seem like, I mean, cruise ships are a lot of old people. True. Uh, so you know people are dying on cruise ships. And I can't imagine that they're turning around, like, back to Fort Lauderdale. Why did you fall when your friends clearly told you not to fall? By the way, did you hear that as you were falling? Her annoying voice, yes. Annie, don't fall! Why'd her voice sound like that? So... Is she a trucker? No. <laughs> she smoke? Everyone asked her does for she cigarettes the whole week. Have you ever been on a real vacation? What do you consider a real vacation? You know, a hotel, land. Yes. yes. All right. Tell me the best story about diarrhea on a cruise ship. I don't think I have one. My brother's friend, though, the last night of a cruise a few years ago, did, like, throw up all night in the bathroom. So me and my friend had to go sleep in the hallway because it smelled so bad. So a little maid woke us up in the morning and was like, you can't sleep here. OK, I don't know what racist accent that was. <laughs> but, she's not, she's, but it was spot on. Yeah. Understood. What a fun drink. It has fish in it. Did you know your friend was a perv and into upskirt videos? He, that was a surprise to all of us. But I mean, she's always been overly friendly. But I, be honest, I didn't. I didn't check. But you can't like pause it and 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 see a shot. No, I don't think you can like actually. Like, okay, good. See. Anything. Were you going commando? No, thank oh. God. Thank goodness. <laughs> Has anybody ever been murdered on a cruise ship while you've been on it? Not that they've let me know. Do they helicopter people off? 
we like picked up people in like a little like rundown ship. Or something. Were you scared that it was uh, it was uh, pirates? No. Do they teach you how to work the hoses to spray the pirates <laughs> off? No. No? no. You get a hose, you spray them. They hate to be sprayed in the face. They're like cats. Pirates are cats. Very much so. Well, careful, you're drunk. <laughs> Attention passengers, the buffet is down to its last 2,000 pounds of popcorn shrimp. Race for the ship! Take me to your cabin. They upgraded me to a room 24 is below sea level. It's right next to the engine on the Mexican cartel storage deck. This is the fastest way to go. I do not do elevators. Are you okay? Are you okay, Annie? Yeah, sorry, I was just having a flashback. I'll never let you fall. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Whee! No, stop talking. I'm almost finished. I look like a fat Kate Winslet. Annie. Uh, I don't feel so good. Well, sure. You're a 17-year-old girl who's been drinking all night long, which I'd like to remind the viewers at home is completely legal in international waters. Maritime law. Maritime law. <laughs> Let's get you some fresh air. There, there. Let it all out. Let it all out. Yeah, it's a big girl. We are no longer in international waters. Okay. Ah! Annie, don't fall. Hey. Annie had a little concussion and washed ashore where she was picked up by Kurt Russell and forced to mother his children. <laughs>